this particular day, we decided to head out to Glendale to visit the Arrowhead Town Center, which is located in Glendale, Arizona. Glendale is on the west side of town. It's about 15 minutes away from where we live at. This is a thriving mall. Um, we showed up about an hour after it had opened, and it, you can already tell there's already getting a small crowd there. So we came in on the side where there is the food court, and I'm going to show you down below where there's a Starbucks. This mall is great for families, especially families with small children. I'm going to show you footage here of the architect of the actual mall itself. It's a beautiful mall, very well lit, <laughs> so you can see where you're going. Um, they have a Disney store, they have an Apple store, Build-A-Bear. Um, yeah, so this is what the ceiling look like. looks like. Very, very nice. footage of their play area. Uh, JB loved to go here when he was smaller. Since he's a little, little older, he doesn't tend to want to play. Um, and there's a train there, which is really nice. Next to the play area is the Disney store. I mean, they were very, very smart in how they laid out the stores in this mall. Um, you're going to see here later on, there's a Disney store. Next to the Disney store is a Builder Bear than a Lego store. So yes, they knew exactly what they were doing to target those families. Here is the Disney store and we were about to head in, but then we noticed this new standalone kiosk type of uh, Bake of Love. It's basically it's owned by the company that uh, owns Build-A-Bear. You build your own cupcakes. A very neat idea. Um, again, there's not a lot of people there because the mall just opened, but I'm going to uh, go around the corner so that you guys can see clips of what the cupcakes look like. I'm not a big cupcake fan, but the, again, this is a great idea. I think you can even host parties here. Pretty cool. He used to be obsessed with cars. Thank you. 
Um, this mall has all of the popular stores. You have your Macy's, J.C. Penney's, and surprisingly enough, their Sears was still open. Two floors with the bottom being mostly clothes and shoes, the top appliances. We're going to go go in just to, you know, take a peek around. They had a bit of a crowd inside and they had some sales going on. So, yeah, again, some footage of what the architects look like. Ryan Little. <laughs> Yoga. This is the first store that's closed down. That store's closed down, right? Don't get too close, JB. This is the only store we've seen that's closed down. It was a jewelry store what? so far. with the restaurants being around the perimeter of the um, this area and then the seating designated in the central very well lit they have your typical restaurant subway chipotle pizza um, Chinese I think there's a Panda Express hey you guys so we've been out of um, Arrowhead Mall now for a while it's I apologize it's a little gloomy and cloudy here in Phoenix today um, so that mall as you can see was very busy actually that wasn't very busy it can get busier than that and they do have events from time to time and we enjoy going to that mall right J right JB yeah. we enjoy going to that mall um, it was interesting because I only saw I was a little distracted with JB and just trying to catch footage but I only saw one store that was closed which is really good um, I also sparked up conversation with a woman um, I, I, I also saw another one you saw another one okay so it was still not as much many stores as we saw at um, Paradise Valley not even close but I sparked up a conversation with a yeah, but, the, but the one with the Sears closed a lot of stores I know that was Paradise Valley Mall. Um, I did spark. A, sorry, I did spark up a, a conversation with someone who works there, and she was interested in why I was filming. And I said, "Oh well, you know, we're going to be taking footage of several malls and outlets here in, locally." And she was very interested in that. And so um, she said, "One mall you want to stay clear from is the Tanger Outlets." And so she gave me a little bit of background. She used to work there a couple of months, and um, the one thing that stuck out to me that I'm like, "Okay, I, I'm not going to go there," is that she mentioned that they don't have any security footage or excuse me any security cameras at that particular mall and there have been incidents of people trying to abduct young children or even women and so that right there is alarming to me so Tanger outlet is in Glendale also and it's right across from the stadium there the Glendale they stadium destroy that mall. <laughs> well, I wouldn't suggest that, but just be very, very careful if you do decide to go to that mall. So interesting. Um, the next, Yay! the next That's mall so I think that we will go to is the Anthem Outlets, which is closer to us than the Glendale, the Arrowhead Mall. But we just wanted to go there. Um, so we will be going to the Anthem Outlets pretty soon. So thank you guys so much for watching. Overall, JB, we thought this mall was pretty good, right? Pretty good. So thank you guys so much for watching. Take care. Bye.